Hey, Entertainment Experiment, this is Fred Greenhalgh, writer, director, and producer of The Cleansed, and it is my esteemed pleasure to be welcoming you to the video version of our post-apocalyptic epic. Now, a few things about the show before it gets started. Uh, first, as you may notice from the fact that you're hearing my voice and not seeing me, this is not video, this is audio drama, which in short means it is a movie for your mind. So peel your eyes off that laptop screen, plug in a set of speakers or earbuds, and go out and experience this story as you experience the outside world. Uh, while the adventure will come with you as you travel, be wary. The cleanse does happen pretty fast and furious, so you've got to pay attention. Um, so a few details that will help you follow the story. The Cleansed Season 1 opens up after a horrific undoing of society called The Breaking. This was documented in the pilot episode of The Cleansed, which is available at thecleansed.com or via SoundCloud. In the pilot, we find that the U.S. has been ravaged by a lack of oil, prolonged overseas wars, um, outages of the electric grid. Things were pretty bad, and then things get worse when a group of militia types attacks the government, and then shit really hits the fan, and then people are escaping as far away as they can from the big cities to try and survive. We follow one group of survivors who settle in a place called The Refuge, which is a uh, basically an airbase in northern Maine, and we encounter these characters 15 years later, in The Cleansed Season 1. Um, over the course of those 15 years, we find out a bit about what has happened at the refuge. We find out that children have been born. Uh, Luke was in the prologue. He's now an adult. And we have Maria, who is new to the world um, since the pilot. Uh, we also have David and Sam, who are characters from the pilot, as well as John Prophet, who appeared in the pilot and left on not-so-great terms with their other characters. So um, all those ghosts of the past start to come into play as we enter the world of The Cleansed Season 1. Um, if this is all confusing, do check out our website, thecleansed.com. We've got character bios, setting information, key plot points, and more. Again, that's thecleansed.com for more of that and to help you understand what this story is all about. But I think um, the story also sort of speaks for itself. So then the lights, open your ears, and experience the world of The Cleansed. <laughs> Dad always told me that when the world went down, it wasn't with a big crash. It was a series of them, like strand after strand snapping from a big web. Did he ever tell you what it was like? No. Well, Mom told me about New York at Christmas time. She told me the millions of people crowded around each other in their own private universes and moving at 100 miles an hour, held together by the ability for things to move, to get from point A to point B. A great, gigantic web of energy. But then, snap. 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 And the world went away. Do you remember that, Luke? Yeah. Yeah, I remember Maria. I remember... I remember through fog as if it were a nightmare. The, the kind you can't wake from. I remember that things got lean at first. That was okay. We moved from place to place. My, my real mom and I, but, but we were together. We had food. We had a roof over our head, right? But then the fighting started. My dad came to get me. And, and then the soldiers came to get him. And... I'm sorry, Luke. No, 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 don't be sorry. But everyone has always been sorry for me. Then tell the story, Luke. You tell it better than anyone. You say it like it was an adventure. Well, it was, wasn't it? <laughs> Time. So? I don't know, Maria. There's just so much to remember. Start at the beginning then, huh? What, with John Prophet? <laughs> John Prophet. Yeah, he was the center of the web that brought all these people together. And then tore them apart. Yeah, that sounds about right, doesn't it? John Prophet the Spider. Oh, tell this story, Luke. Tell them all about John Headstrong Prophet who nearly killed us all trying to save us. Okay. Okay, Maria, I'll do my best. John, someone's behind us. Quiet, Zeke. It's okay, we're close. Will the train be ready to go? I sure hope so. Right. Come on, everyone, keep moving. Yes, sir. Come right along. What's that? Hold up, lay low, hold up. I heard Quiet. 
We got incoming. Who could they? Not this fast. We should have an hour, maybe more. No, no. What's happening, Joe? Quiet, Zeke. Everyone stay calm. We can get to the train. It's only about a hundred yards past this corner. It's too late! Yeah. For God's sakes, calm down! Zeke, have you seen Saul? No. Where is he? Where the hell is he? He's supposed to be here with supplies. Up ahead! Yeah. Everyone, stop firing! Keep moving! Come on! We need to get away! They're coming, John! They're coming! I can see it! Zeke, come on! Move your feet! Yes, John! Uh, <laughs> yes! Yes! I know! Move! Move! Move through it! <laughs> Run! Zeke! John, come on! There's no time! Zeke! Zeke! They're fighting us! Well, damn it, then let's fight! Don't listen to them. Keep fighting. We can't do this. They got us. Oh, for God's sake, throw some ball. They're storming us. Pull back. Pull back. No, no, no. Stay put. Stay put. God damn it. Stay together. Stay together. Help, John. Help. I'm coming. John, where are you going? This train has to leave the station. Right on. But for God's sake, Zeke, come on, fight! The train can't wait anymore! John! The train can't wait! You have to fight! Fight! Abraham, are you ready? I just got on. Ah. I've, got to, I've got to grab Zeke. There's no time we've got to get on. But Zeke! I can't protect myself! John! Please! Damn it! You coming or what? Okay. Okay! Fire her up! John! Please help me, John! Down! All you pisses down! I need you! Down.